Hi there, Izzy from DigitalGoja.com showrooms and they've posted a couple of questions on our forums about how to work with the 2.2x Super Telephoto lens adapters. This one happens to be the Altura version. Number one, we always have to make sure that since these adapt to the front of our lens, you have to purchase the correct filter thread size because they actually thread on just like a filter. So for example, this one happens to be an 18 to 135 EFS lens. So this is a 67 millimeter diameter thread. So then here we have the 2.2x teleconverter with a 67 millimeter diameter thread. So number one, we have to prepare for this. First, set your lens to manual focus. You want to make sure that this is zoomed out to give you a little bit of room and that it is on manual focus so that we don't run the gamut of stripping the gears for the autofocus system. So we're now going to remove the rear cap and then we're going to thread it on as if we were attaching a filter. Now, this is lightly threaded on. You don't want to over stress this onto the lens because then you run the gamut of stripping the filter threads and damaging your lens also. Now here's the next part. We highly recommend that you still work on manual focus because this lens is meant to work on autofocus when there's very little in the front. When you now attach a larger chunk of optic in the front it's going to become really difficult for it to focus. So you have to switch it to manual focus. If you're comfortable, you can still keep working with all your different auto settings. So that doesn't mean that you have to switch to manual aperture or shutter priority or any of that. But it is recommended to use manual focus. Now, secondary, here's the other issue. This is an 18 to 135. When we put a 2.2x converter, now we're talking closer to a 270, 300 millimeter. You always have to remember this. Whenever you magnify the subject, the more you magnify, the steadier you have to maintain your lens. Plus, you're also adding additional weight to this, so it no longer feels the same as you were comfortable with your 18 to 135. You have to get more comfortable with the added weight. It becomes front heavy. And then your shutter speed has to compensate for it, because remember, it is more of a magnification so your shutter speed has to compensate by being able to pick a faster shutter speed to guarantee less movement and remember this optical stabilization system only works for this portion of the lens when you add something else that now gives you more magnification and more weight the optical stabilization no longer functions because that works internally in the lens not with an external input so you have to take into consideration that this now has to be worked in a situation where you're honestly going to either work with faster shutter speeds and higher ISOs or you're going to guarantee to maintain it steady by working with a monopod or a tripod. If not, you are going to run the gamut of getting blurry images. So remember, number one, manual focus. Number two, make sure your camera is set to faster shutter speeds to be able to compensate for movement because of the magnification ratio. And number three, to keep it steady, the optical stabilization is no longer going to work with the external lens, so you are going to have to consider working with a monopod or a tripod. If this video was helpful to you and you like it, click on the like button underneath. And also, subscribe to our channel. Happy shooting!